Ja, liebe Adlerfans, liebe Medienvertreter, ich darf Sie recht herzlich zur Pressekonferenz hier in der SAP Arena begrüßen. Nach dem Spiel der Adler Mannheim gegen die Krefeld Pinguine. Ich begrüße auch beide Trainer, Ricardo Ono und natürlich unseren Headcoach Jeff Ward. Und dann hören wir jetzt die Stimmen zum Spiel. Herr Odo Ono, Ihr Kommentar bitte. Ja, yeah, danke schön. Guten Abend zusammen. Uh, congratulations, uh, Jeff. Sehr gut uh, Job gemacht heute mit der Mannschaft. Und uh, das Beispiel für uh, heute, uh, der erste Bully. Der erste Bully. Der Mittelecker, unsere Mannschaft, wir gucken mal das Video äh, dreimal an der Special Bully und äh, Mannheim hat einen Breakaway in der ersten erste Wechsel und das ist nicht gut. Und dann zwei Tore, zwei schnelle Tore und äh, die Schlitzulaufen für Mannheim heute war sehr gut, sehr gut passen, äh, gut Kampf, besser Kampf als unsere Mannschaft heute. Uh, all the situation Mannheim heute was better than Krefeld. And this is a problem for uns hier Mannschaft. Our Auschwitz spiel is wichtig for our Mannschaft. And uh, the Heim spiel is good, normal. The last three years, sehr good Auschwitz spiel. And this year, nicht good Auschwitz spiel. And um, we must be better. Um, and uh, so, uh, again, vielen Glück, Jeff. And, uh, Mannheim war uh, sehr gut heute, sehr gut. Dankeschön. Vielen Dank, Herr Rono. Jeff, your statement, please. Yeah, thanks, Rick. Uh, it was, uh, <coughs> I think for us, sort of the tale of two hockey games uh, where we <coughs> weren't uh, as sharp in some areas on uh, Friday. I thought the guys were real sharp today. And uh, we just had one of those games where everything seemed to go our way. Um, We were extremely happy with the way that we rebounded from the game the other night. Uh, we were extremely happy with the way that we worked. And because of that, we were able to work, work through some breaks. And uh, it, was a, it was a real solid hockey game by our, by our guys tonight. Um, you know, I, I, the one thing is it's awful, hard to, it's awful hard when you have to kill as many penalties as, as uh, Krefeld had to kill tonight. And um, you know, we didn't score a lot of power play goals, but I thought our, our guys did a really good job of maintaining offensive zone time. And, creating some momentum for us and, and uh, the penalty killers on the other side had to spend an awful lot of time and an awful lot of energy doing things tonight and as a result that uh, you know that does hurt the five on five play and um, as I said we were able to generate some momentum from that tonight and I, I thought uh, it stood us in good stead. Thanks Jeff. Also um das nochmal kurz zusammenzufassen, ähm, Jeff sagt, die Adler haben heute ein gutes Spiel gemacht, es lief eigentlich alles nach Plan. Ähm, die Mannschaft hat gut gearbeitet und eine solide Leistung gezeigt, ähm, obwohl sie oftmals in Powerplay auch ähm, ran durften, haben sie nicht viele Powerplay-Tore geschossen, aber trotzdem viel Zeit in der offensive Zone gehabt und uh, unterm Strich ist er sehr zufrieden mit der Leistung seiner Mannschaft. Gibt es jetzt an dieser Stelle Fragen von Seiten der Presse? Jeff, um, is there anything uh, to criticize except that you, your team had 57 shots and only scored five times? Well, I'm, <laughs> I'm not going to criticize our team for scoring five times on 57 shots. I mean, um, if you ask any coach in this league if they take five goals in a game, they'd say yes, no matter how many shots you had. So, um, you know, I, I think... What we were pleased with tonight was that we scored some hard goals, you know, tips in front of the net, uh, you know, driving net for rebounds, uh, getting, you know, getting to the hard areas to score. I thought we did it tonight, and uh, that was, uh, you know, much, much better for us that way. So the, the fact we were able to score some goals that way is, uh, is a positive for our team. And just one more question, Jeff. Um, Last couple of power plays, I think the last two, um, there was were the third and the fourth line on the ice. Was it a credit for them? Well, no, we practice all our guys in the power play, and I just, you know, they did, they've been working hard, and um, you know, we we um, we want to be a team that has good depth. You never know when you're going to lose a guy to injury, and uh, I just felt at that time in the game with how much some of the other guys had played, it was a good opportunity to get those guys out there and. And uh, I thought they responded very well to it. They, uh, they worked extremely hard to, you know, keep pucks and um, win battles and get pucks to the net and so on. So uh, we're not, um, you know, we're not locked into just two, two kind of units. And, you know, we want to make sure that we've got guys that are ready to step in and play if, uh, you know, 
the other units aren't going or we, we have some injuries in those areas. So it's, a, it's an area that we like to uh, develop some depth in, and I thought the guys did a good job with it. Gibt es sonst noch Fragen? Das ist nicht der Fall. Dann darf ich mich im Namen der Adler bei allen Fans, Partnern und Sponsoren für die tolle Unterstützung heute bedanken. Wir wünschen unseren Gästen noch eine gute Heimreise zurück nach Krefeld. Und wir sehen uns dann wieder am 2.11. hier zu Hause zum Familientag gegen die Straubing Tigers. Bis dahin noch einen schönen Sonntagabend. Bis bald.